What's up YouTube? So we're back with another video today. I know it's been a little while since I've made a video, but I do have some exciting updates. I actually just got a brand new toolbox for work and I'll drop a picture of that now. And now I'm trying to fill that thing with tools. And as you guys may or may not have known, I had a little blue tool cart and I had a little black tool cart which I just sold the black one today, which helped me get this tool right here, but it was for a hell of a deal, a hell of a deal. Let me stop talking. Let's flip this camera around and show you this deal I just got. So that's right everybody, I actually got me the Cobalt 3 8 Cordless Impact. Now, I've been wanting a cordless impact for work, and I've been kind of real stuck on the decision, should I get Snap-on, Milwaukee, Craftsman, DeWalt, Cobalt, Matco, and after looking over tons of videos and hours of research, I've come to the conclusion that this is the best bang for your buck. Now let me tell you why. So I went into Lowe's today to get this tool, this tool right here in my hand is $100. And now they don't sell a kit for this one. You have to get a battery, which you can get the bigger four amp hour battery or the smaller two amp hour battery. The two amp hour battery is like $25. The four amps, I think like 45 ish. And then you have to buy a charger separate from that. So that's gonna be about 170 altogether. But what I ended up finding out is if you get this little tool kit right here, it's a charger and both size batteries. For 129 you can actually get it a free tool so i got this tool for free for buying this charging kit right here now i saved around 50 dollars doing that and they have way more tools there. they have a half inch impact they got cordless saws angle grinders shot vacs all kinds of cool stuff but let's just go into the unboxing of this tool and I'll tell you why I think it's the best and why it probably is the best bang for your buck right now. So right off the way, we can see that it has 2300 RPMs of max speed. It's got a max run time of 3.6 times longer. It says a max power of 150 foot pounds, but I'll tell you why I think that it's breakaway is more than that in a minute. And then max motor life up to 10 times longer. And just look at that. It's just a beautiful tool. I love the blue of cobalt. Blue is my favorite color. And it's so compact and tight. Now let's bust this bad boy open and show you what you get in this here box. So right off the bat, here's the tool. Beautiful, beautiful looking tool. 24 volt brushless 3 8 You got the selector right there for on and off. Pretty, you know, pretty self-explanatory. And now I just love the color of this tool. It's just so, so beautiful. You have a little plastic right there on the anvil. Go ahead and pull that off. And just look how beautiful this tool is. Something about new tools just gets me really, really excited. You got a little light right here at the very front of it. You got the anvil ring on it. Now you also get an option of one, two, and three for how much power you want to put down. If you don't want to put that much, go to one. You want to put a little more, two. You want full max torque, do three. And now let's put this down. And then we have the instruction manual here, but we don't really care about that. We know how to operate a 3 8 gun. So now let's open this up and pop a battery in there. So it took a while, but I finally got the charger and the two batteries. Now, if you look at the charger, it's 24 volt max lithium ion. It's gonna have the battery kind of flashing for charging green for fully charged red for it's too hot or too cold and the red with the x for a completely dead battery so i'm guessing there's your indicator right there 
just your normal little plug-in. It's pretty long. It feels nice and sturdy. Then you got the big battery, the four amp hour battery, and then the little battery, the two amp hour battery. Now both these batteries have charge indicators on them. This one's half charged right out the box. That's kind of cool. It's a nice bright green color. You can't miss it. Got the nice little cobalt symbol there. Extended runtime. And then the two amp hour battery, also halfway charged right out the box. So now we'll stick it in the gun. And there it is with the two amp hour battery. Now let's test this thing out. Right off the bat, it feels kind of torquey. Oh, that's a nice bright light. You guys check that out. Look how bright that is. So you'll definitely be able, looks like a little flashlight. You'll definitely be able to see right away what you're working with. And then we'll check out this. We got one, just let's listen to it. Kind of slow. Two. And then we got three. So if you need to slow it down, speed it up, you get that option right there. And it's just two release buttons. Now let's put on the big battery, the four amp hour battery. It just feels more torquey with that four amp hour battery on there, but it's a lot bigger as you can tell. It looks kind of funny there, it's all big and bulky. But then three, Two, one. So my first review and first thought on this Cobalt tool is got to be that I absolutely love it. And now what I said earlier about how this tool is better than the Snap-on tool, the Milwaukee and all that, is if you go watch this one guy called Coon Trucking, he's a big guy that talks about Snap-on tools, Matco tools, he's a big diesel mechanic, big fan of the guy. If you check out his channel, he did actually a torque test on this. He put on a semi-wheel. He set his torque wrench to 220 foot-pounds, and that broke it loose at 220 foot-pounds in reverse. While if you look at the Milwaukee, the Stubby 3.8s, that broke it loose only up to 215. And that cordless little snap-on 14-volt gun, I'm sure a lot of you know what that is. It's a very, very cool gun. I love it but that only broke it down 190. So this tool is doing absolutely dominating on the market. DeWalt only did up to 90. It wasn't on this same channel, but you just hear not the greatest reviews about it. But I'm very excited to put this thing to work, take it to work, and then after about a couple of weeks or so, I'll bring in another update video of what I think of the tool. Do I like it? Do I recommend it still? But let's flip this camera around and do the outro. Another really cool thing about these 24 volt is that these batteries are interchangeable just about every cobalt product out there they have on the market now. As you can see on the box, you got vacuum cleaners, blowers, drills, lights, sawzalls, weed eaters, all kinds of cool stuff that all fit those batteries. So you got the batteries, you can buy any tool and already have the battery for it. So there you guys go. There's the unboxing and first thoughts on the new Cobalt 38s cordless impact now the reason i got this is i just do a lot of brake jobs i do a lot of mechanic work because i am an automotive technician as some of you know and i'm still going to school to be a nurse but a 3 8 gun like this i've been wanting for a while and i finally found a good deal today at lowe's it ends in three days so if you see this video now go check it out it's worth it but it's just nice to get in those little smaller spots it's not the smallest most compact gun but for the price and what I needed to do, it worked just fine. So if you guys like the video, give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, and remember to subscribe for more content. And as always, you guys, peace out.